What's up, guys? I'm Jay. Today we'll be checking out Live It Up by Sons of Zion. Okay, first of all, seeing this in my subscription feed, I'm like, hell yes. I'm definitely going to react to this. Huge fan of Sons of Zion, seen them several times in concert, well basically at the pub, performing a few of the classics. Kiwi classic these days I like to prefer them as. And whenever I hear ends of reggae it makes me homesick. Homesick to the days. That's why I don't often listen to it unless I'm getting pissed. Then it's okay for me to get into that zone of being homesick because then I'm usually back in that player state of mind where I'm in the club scoping out looking for a nice wahine. Let's check it out. Enough rambling. You know, I'm always rambling before these videos. It is what it is. Let's go. It's also Saturday today, so perfect time to be listening to this. Request Dance Crew. I follow this chick on Instagram. She is very easy on the arms. Can throw it out there. Can barely talk right now because she's on screen. Turn this up a little bit. You know, you know you're an NZ when you just see people staring because there's a camera around. Ah, oh, they are kids, by the way. So, kids will be kids. She's very easy on the eye. Wasn't it her birthday? Wasn't it her birthday recently? I'm not a stalker. It's very observant. It's almost got like a Bruno Mars feel to the song. All the top shelf. Look at her, she just lights up the whole street. Hey, I'm digging these lyrics too. I mean, she's surprised there's not as many people staring, you know. People love it when the camera's around her, they can't help but stare at the camera. You know, I'm loving it, this whole music video is based around here right now. trying to make this awkward but it is what it is that is so sick See, the people are just so awkward, man. I feel awkward watching these people looking. What the hell's going on? Thank God there's some normal person that just joins in. You know, I love this girl's confidence right now. You have to be to be as successful as she is right now, along with the rest of the girls in Paris, obviously. I'm trying very hard not to kiss ass right now. You know, I get a bit silly, a bit carried away when there's a beautiful girl on screen. Especially when it's a Kiwi girl. She's obviously got a partner. I'm just talking out my ass right now. I love that song. 
Can't go wrong with Sons of Zion. I shit you not. I don't even remember the last time they put out a bad song. I don't think they ever have. Same goes with House of Shame, Catch a Fire. Now I put them all on the same bar. It's homegrown music right there. It's exactly what I expected. I'm liking the direction that these boys are going with their music. Usually I expect something that's more on the reggae side. But this had more of a pop feel. Bruno Mars feel. Or maybe a hint of reggae. But that was definitely a bop. As a lot of you guys like to say. Got me using your slang. I am very looking forward to hearing more music from the boys. And just Kiwi music in general because I have been getting very very little ends of requests which kind of makes no sense because I've been seeing a lot of Kiwi moldy names in the subscription feed subscription list give me something Stan Walker is off limits I've already seen it if I've already seen it defeats the purpose of a reaction give me something else Twitter is also off the cards I knew Twitter before they even blew up before you guys even knew them take it off the list give me something else Pretty please. And yeah, that kind of got me in the mood right now, not gonna lie. It's very early in the morning, a little too early to start. It's 9 21 a.m. as we speak. But you know what? Being a Maori from New Zealand, I was never too early. I'll see you in the next video.